Hello guys, welcome to day 13 of the 31 days of Halloween. The movie I'm going to be talking about today is Hatchet. Let's do it! Now the Hatchet movies, starring Kane Hodder, they are about a over the top monster killer that lives in the New Orleans swamps and it's called Victor Crowley, awesome name. Basically they're just your fun schlock over the top killing um, over the top deaths of a deformed monster killer that lives, like I say once again, on the swamps. Now, if you're in the tones of Friday the 13th, it's got that sort of element, but it's more over the top and a bit more funny, cheesy. It, they're not really well... To say they're not well made, I wouldn't. I don't want to be harsh, but they're not, you know, they don't have the budget of these movies. They're not um, particularly expensive, though I do like them. I do... I think the fourth the one um, is probably the weakest, but uh, there's only four, but uh, the first three I really enjoy as well, and I just feel like it does what it says on the tin, and I don't feel there's enough of these movies, there's no secret to them, there's no... Um, you know, there is a bit of backstory as you watch the movies later on. Uh, like, two, it explains a bit more about him. <clears throat> and he is sort of like a... You do sort of feel sorry for him, but then they kind of just make him out to be a fucking horrific killer. Um, but no, Victor Crowley, he's not on your A, a tier of killers. You know, like your Freddy's, your Jason's, your Michael's. It's probably not even like the B, what I would call Ghostface, um, Pinhead, that type of thing. It's probably C. But no, it's very refreshing. And like it says on the front, you know, it's not a remake. It's not a Japanese remake. It's not a true story. It's not an old folk legend. It's like just good old American violence. <laughs> so, no. Uh, uh, and... I do like how they explore the mythos a bit more when they try and kill him off in the later films and he comes back and why that is. But not if you just want something balls to the wall, over the top killing, uh, just very fun and you're not really bothered about the acting, then Hatchet is definitely up there. And even watch either one of them, to be fair. Excuse me. Really fun movies and I've had a blast watching them always do always fun to watch and I've even got a Victor Crowley figure so not sure how much I like uh, Hatchet so yeah guys um, thank you for watching that was Hatchet for day 13 of 31 days of Halloween take care and I'll see you in the next one bye